Hey what's up guys and welcome to the Head Start Lab series Volume 5 on Music Production. Now this is a free tutorial brought to you by the Recording Connection Audio Program, the only program that gets you inside a real studio where you learn from industry professionals on their equipment. In this video series we're going to show you everything that you need to know about music production. And all these videos were made from real tutoring sessions at the Recording Connection. So in addition to learning in a real professional studio, all of our students receive free unlimited tutoring sessions while in the program. Let's go ahead and begin. Hey, what's up everyone? Eddie Martinez here with Recording Radio and Film Connection and welcome back to the Head Start Lab series. Now in today's video, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be learning how to use sidechain compression. And we're going to be doing that with these two instruments here. A very simple kick drum playing quarter notes and then another simple instrument sound. In this case, it's a bass sound uh, playing whole notes and looks like half notes here. So essentially, we're going to use this kick drum and sidechain it to this uh, it looks like bass sound to create a little bit of a sidechain pumping action here. So let's go ahead and check out our electro bump. Now the very first thing that we're going to want to do here is we're going to want to go down to our sand area and create a bus. We're going to want to go to our first available bus, which in this case is bus number four. We're going to select that. Now next, what we're going to want to do is go over to this dial over here and set it to zero, zero dB. Another way you could do this is by simply clicking on uh, the dial and hitting option. Awesome. Next, what we're going to want to do is we're going to want to go over to our mixer and delete an auxiliary track, which, is, which was just created right now. It looks like it, it was auxiliary track number eight. Now, we don't need this in our mix, so let's go ahead and delete it. All we need to do is select delete anyways, and now it's gone. Okay, cool. Now onto the connection part. What we're going to need to do is we're going to need to go ahead and send um, our bus four into our instrument. And the way we're going to do this is by using a compressor. So we're going to go down to our uh, audio effects over here, go down to dynamics, to compressor, then stereo. Now at the very top, you'll see right here something that says sidechain. All we're going to need to do is click on where it says none and go down to bus number four. Now what's happening here is that this instrument is sending bus number four's uh, sound into our compressor, into our bus number four in the side chain. That's going to connect the two. Now from here, all we need to do is start playing around with these parameters until we hear the sound that we want to hear. Let's first hear how that sounds without any effect whatsoever. So it sounds interesting, but not too fun. We can obviously use this to liven up our sound and give it a pumping and breathing effect. So let's go ahead and start messing with our compressor threshold, our ratio, our knee, and our tack and release. So that's how you use sidechain compression in Logic Pro X. So are there any artists that you like that use sidechain compression? I personally like Dead Mouse. Go ahead and leave your comments and thoughts down below. Peace. Thanks for watching this video. And if you're watching this video and you're not currently enrolled to the Recording Connection, this is only a small taste of what you could be learning in our program. The Recording Connection provides all of our students with industry standard software, like Pro Tools, to take your engineering skills to the next level. We also provide books with excellent lesson plans, a professional studio engineer who will mentor you and show you how to operate real studio equipment, and so much more. With the Recording Connection, getting finance is a breeze. We have many different tuition options, so getting hooked up at a studio near you is fast and easy. For more information, check out www.recordingconnection.com. And of course, I'll catch you guys on the next video.